Shana Lohr. Sharon Kyo. Thank you very much, and Cahirlach, uh, thank you very much. I want to thank you and uh, Senator Bortemar uh, for running this house so smoothly over the last six months. And I want to thank Martin and Bridget in the Shannon office, our research and library, the Bill's office, um, helping me out this year with the, the Gratham on Uchtron Bill. And although the, the government might want to see me go away on that bill, I probably will try and get it into the, into the house before uh, Christmas. I want to thank Alan uh, Ruan and all his team of ushers and Julie and John and the catering staff who make life around this uh, house really, really easy for us all. Um, I want to thank Gráinne and Mark and Robert in my office um, for all the support and help they give me and my colleagues in the independent group who try and keep me on the straight and narrow and sometimes fail, but uh, I, I still do try. And they do try as well. Um, but it's interesting because yeah, there's a couple of things that are coming forward next year, and particularly in, the, in, to, in relation to the or next term, the hate speech bill, which really is the cornerstone of our democracy. And I really, really hope that the, 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 my colleagues in this chamber will scrutinise that bill and will bin it, 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 it as such. There's another thing that, that I really want to try and get to talk to in the House before we finish up with the children in care and the grooming and the allegations that were made in, in a report recently. I didn't, I didn't happen to get onto the, the Children's Committee before um, the summer recess, but I'm hoping that it's going to happen in, in September, October time. But, you know, this is a watershed moment for RT. It's a watershed moment for everybody in politics, and it's all about trust at the end of the day. And people trust us. They trust us to run the state correctly. Um, they, they trust... Um, organisations state corporate in state corporate gov governance, and we are the guardians of that. So it's so important that we stand up for trust in this house. And uh, if if we learn nothing else about what's happening downstairs, we have to learn that that is the cornerstone of what people want us to do. They want us. They want to trust in us, and we have to have trust in those organisations out there that are doing what they're supposed to be doing for the people of Ireland. Thank you.